Hello heroes, Kelthar of the Heroes and Legends, and uh, because more bugs and more bugs keep appearing on the Legion Veda, well, I decided to do another artifact weapon mission here for you. I'm doing the Retribution Paladin, so I don't know where I'm at actually right now. I think it's going to make me do some quest differently, so we'll see how that goes. Because um, I'm standing in front of Khadgar in a for instanced version of Dalaran. <laughs> So we'll do. We'll see where this goes. Oh dang it! This thing keeps popping in this room. Who's it chasing? He's chasing this dude. Can't handle it. Okay. So basically, just ignore it. Try not to get hurt. Everyone's gonna die because no one wants to fight it. <laughs> okay, so here I am on my freshly created, never before played a paladin in my life. Scratch that. I played a paladin up to like level 12 and then said nope. Hopefully that doesn't happen again. I have to get through this quest line. Alright, so let's talk to Khadgar. Let's do this. Knowledge is power. The Legion bears but down on us. It wisely Could be a moment to spare. The shockwave of arcane energies we are about to unleash should prove powerful enough to send them back to their cursed dimension for a time, giving us time to catch our breath and begin the search for the pillars of creation. I am ready. Begin the teleportation of Dalaran to the Where Broken you Isles. Oh. Well then, it's just this scene, this really cool scene. It's like, oh dang. Citizens of Azeroth! I'll let you guys watch because it's cool. Today is the day we turn the tide! Today is the day that we retake our world and send the Legion back to the hell that spawned them! Our path is clear! The pillars of creation await on the Broken Isles! Funny thing is though, those floating islands next to Dalaran didn't exist until the Broken Isles, so... Therefore, ergo vis-a-vis -vis shouldn't be there. Greetings. Ah, Gladius, it's good to see you on your feet. The members of the Council of Sis are recuperating from their ordeal. Teleportation, I've already gone through this. Let's get my stuff. You. Tome of Tranquil Mind, we'll hold on to that for... Stuff. Okie doke. Okay, he's telling me to go... Wait. Doesn't usually somebody start talking to me randomly. Time to mount up and go until someone starts talking to me. A quest should appear for my artifact weapon at some point. Thank the light I found you. I oh. must speak with you at once. It's Lord Maxwell Tyrosis. At your service. Energy gathering. A critical decision must be made. Oh, well, hold on. Did anyone notice how he just kind of like <sighs> popped in front of me really fast like that? The Legion devastated our forces at the Broken Shore. The mightiest army this world has ever known was reduced to cinders in moments. We must gather those with the conviction to save our home. Travard of Tears Guard and Auric Trueheart have each made plans to do just that. But we must not let them walk alone. I ask that you seek them out and guide them to Crassus Landing so that we may make this decision together. Gather Travard and Auric Trueheart. Then meet Lord Ty Maxwell Tyrosis at Crassus Landing. Walk. Excellent. Meet me at Crassus's landing when you are ready. Huh. There's one already in here. This is... Or, oh, wait. Wait. Hello. Is this... No offense, but I don't have time to chat. I have a shield to find. You need to urgently at Crassus's landing first. Tyros has sent me. See ya around. Excellent. Tyros is... Now oh. he's a good man. 
Count me in. There's too much danger about to turn down a wee bit of help. All right. We may not be alone in this after all, Tahu. Let's see what Tyrosis has to say. Tahu Sage Wind. Interesting. That's definitely not the dwarf that I was thinking about from uh, the wagon. Leona's Leona's wagon. There was like the two dudes. Oh wait. Dudes over here Even checking out. Even if no one here will help us, we must fulfill our duty. <laughs> Let us pray that what remains of our order will be enough. For tear. You think you walk in the path of the light? Oh wait, you think you you walk in the path of light? What guides you here this day? Come to Crassus Landing. We may be able to help your order. May Tyr guide you. If there's any chance of finding aid, Efrina and I will come. <laughs> aid on Breaker. We should get name our mounts. Get all into that kind of stuff. Dawn Breaker. It's a cool name for a mount. He breaks the dawn. I'm glad you could join us. Oh yeah. So you got Vindicator Boros, a Pawnee Brightmane of the Sunwalkers. Yeah. Lady Leadrin, the Blood Knight Matriarch. Oh dang, it's all going down. Too bad certain people aren't here. But if you saw or read the the uh, comic for. Um, Anduin, the new king, and you know what, it's way past spoilers at this point, looks like he becomes a paladin. It totally looks like it. Or just a really powerful priest. I'm leaning towards paladin. Anyways, let's continue. Azeroth will not fall while Thank we you for helping us gather together, Gladios. We must stand united. Weapons of Legend. Our gathering has identified several weapons of immense power. In the right hands, these holy artifacts give us a fighting chance against the Legion. We cannot pursue all of them at once. We risk too much if we spread ourselves that thin. We must agree on where our efforts are best focused. That is why I ask you here, Gladios. As one of our greatest champions, you must be our voice of reason and decide our next move. Select an artifact weapon to pursue. Take care, brothers and sisters. We must not forget the Ashbringer. Tyrion may be gone, but the High Blade is still out there somewhere. Well, that's what we're going for. So if you went holy, which I'm not, you get the Silver Hand. I'll try it at some point. I'll, I'll, I'll read them to you right now. Let's see what you, a little bit of preview lore. A secret order of holy, a secret order of paladins has been watching over the resting place of the Great Titan Watcher Tyr for hundreds of years. Histories tell that his powerful warhammer was buried there with him. Recent events have threatened the safety of their secret charge and they have appealed for help from paladins across the across Azeroth. Tyr replied that he did not consider his Argent Hand a reminder of defeat. For him it was a symbol of the sacrifice he had made to defend Azeroth and he wanted the world to see it that way as well. So Tyr, the Watcher, the Silver Hand is named after him because his hand was chopped off and that it's here it's his hand but it's probably gonna look like a hammer so i don't know i'm pretty sure he didn't walk around with a hammer for a hand um he's got it's, it's funny how it's kind of tied the warriors arms artifact uh was kind of is wielded by the human king and he was he found tears uh, resting place and the monster that tear fell fighting so that makes it stronger than Tyr if I beat him on my arms, warrior? Whatever. Protection. An ancient Vrykul saga speaks of a shield crafted by Tyr himself. During the Winter Scorn War, it was used to expose Loken's lies to the Vrykul and convert many to Tyr's cause. The final resting place of the shield was lost to time, but rumors point to one who might know the final chapters of its story. The Truth Guard. With the first hammer fall, rivers of magma spilled from the icy mountains. With the second, the sky howled and lightning set the heavens aflame. With the third, a single ray of sunlight pierced the storm clouds and whispered over Truthguard's surface. Killing for the sake of killing, conquering for the sake of conquest. There is no honor in such things. There is only shame and regret. That's pretty cool. Finally, the truth, probably the most like storied weapon in one of the most storied weapons in Warcraft history, the Ashbringer. 
During our failed assault on the broken shore, High Lord Tyrion Forgering was lost, and with him our greatest weapon against the Legion, the Ashbringer. We need to find the Ashbringer and recover it at all costs. So it was that over the course of time, the man and the weapon seemed as one. Ashbringer became a name of legend, attributed not just to the fearsome blade, but also to the relentless knight who wielded it. Funny thing, I followed a Twitch streamer by the name of Sparty Smallwood, and back, way, way back in vanilla, you could get the corrupted form of this weapon from Naxxramas, and if you got it before the patch, a patch came that took it out of the game for the for the next, I think before the next, the expansion that moved Naxxramas, um, you got to keep wielding it, so people obviously kept it for its sentimental value, then Transmog came about, and after Transmog came about, uh, you know, those that owned the original weapon, the Corrupted Ashbringer, were able to change their two-handed weapons into a Corrupted Ashbringer, which is cool. I'll show you guys. Maybe I'll cut in some footage here. Um, basically, so anyways, cutting to the chase, he basically found a glitch that allowed him to... Uh, he had, like, a group of followers on Twitch, and if you followed him and watched his like twice a week, I think he still he probably still does it, twice a week, unless the, it's been patched out, but twice a week, he goes into the, uh, the stockades in Stormwind, he's Alliance, he goes into the stockades in Stormwind, and he takes the lucky random winner from chat, and he takes them in there, goes through, beats on some dudes, finally kills Hoggard, Hoggard drops a two-handed piece of crap weapon, um, and if it drops, he takes that weapon, he transmogs that two-handed piece of crap weapon into the Corrupted Ashbringer. And you're able to, through some glitch or loophole, trade items within two hours, uh, even after a transmogging. Uh, at the time, anyways, I'm still not sure if it still works, but I was one of those lucky winners, so my warrior has a transmogged two-handed piece of crap weapon that looks like Corrupted Ashbringer. So when I want to walk around town, Corrupted Ashbringer on my back. I can't. So anyway, sorry. Little tangent there. Let's go do this. Are you sure you wish to pursue? Yes, I do. We will prevail. Weapons of Legend. Excellent choice. There's no time to waste. You can always count on me. High Lord Tyrion may be gone, but the Ashbringer is still out there somewhere. Its power would devastate the Legion. We must find it. I wish it were as simple as returning to where Tyrion fell, it could be anywhere on that infernal landscape by now. I believe an old friend can help us find the blade. I ask that you place your faith in me and journey to Uther's tomb in the Plaguelands. We will seek answers there. I saw the original playthrough of the Ashbringer and I think it was I think it's been changed since because the original one, you actually went and found Tyrion struggling and then you he hands you the blade as he dies, so that might have been changed. Maybe not. Maybe it works its way in somehow. Meet Lord Maxwell Tyrosis at Uther's tomb in Western Place. So maybe they found a way to sneak Uther in. May the light should leave for Uther's tomb. Who's gonna fly me there? The Delarin Port of Delarin Crater. Fly to Uther's tomb. What? I got a Delarin Portal. Enter the chamber of the guardian. Wait. Check the map out. Oh, yeah, chamber of the guardian. Now I gotta go. Do, do, do. Okay. I don't have a. Oh, you know what? I have to macro a uh, sh one quick, quick second here, guys. We're gonna quick macro slash dismount. I just don't like having to manually dismount. Oh wait, that's not what it's supposed to be called. Uh, what ability are we tying it to? We're gonna tie it to Crusaders. No, I have to tie it to the number one key. So I have to tie it to Divine Storm. Okay, keep that on slash dismount and then slash cast dip. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I got a better idea. Open the spell book. 
Where is it? Divine Storm. Let's cast Divine Storm. Save and look at the icon changes. Drop it on my bar. Now when I'm mounted, I can dismount using the same button I dismount with all my characters. Hold on, hold it on, that's a daily drop that portal don't go unprepared. I don't know. Are you gonna buy a tell me something? Oh. Some gliders. Sure. I'll take some gliders. Glad I could help. Where is it? Can I buy a bunch? I'll totally just spam by them from Well, spread it out. Keep it real. I'm one of those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pleasure doing business with ya. Let's buy a bunch. Harry's back. Hmm. Interesting. Have a good one. Yeah. What do you want? Be good. Time is money, friend. Be careful out there. All right. Let's do this. Do, 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 do. Invisible camera flying in. Alright. Actually, nope, we gotta fly there. Jeweled Onyx Panther. Let us move. Gotta move it. Uther's Tomb awaits. There's no Paladin mount that lets me, uh, like, fly. What's the name of this weapon I got? Duskbreaker Wormwall. It's a boring name. The Ruins of Alterac. Man, the human kingdoms have really been through it in their time. You know what's funny? Now I think about it. I was thinking about uh, Anduin again and his comic at the end it shows him sitting there all old and stuff, ready to fight the Legion. Does that mean we're not gonna take the final fight till he's like an old dude? Not only that, he's standing there next to um, uh, standing next to Velen and Velen seemed pretty pissed at the end of that quest line but someone did say yeah he's like uh, but he's like let's prepare the Prepare the thing as you look. Right, we'll see. It'll all come together. I know. I know that'll bring. will uh. Take care of it. Ooh. It seems the High Lord's absence has affected more than <coughs> just the living. At your service. These brave watchers require aid. The light may will ignore our prayers if we choose not to help our brethren. I will prepare the ceremony while you assist. Oh, our questing time! I'm the first time what fighting. We must ensure that those buried here are never again disturbed. Their spirits' very presence only further perturbs the light. He's a priest. This cannot continue. I must maintain this barrier to ensure none of the wayward souls enter the Lightbringer's resting place. They've actually changed his tomb up a little bit. If you can purify the graves themselves, this madness can finally cease. Purify the graveyards of Sorrow Hill. And then you want me to kill some Victory dudes. lies ahead! The lost souls roaming the cemetery grounds have been drawn to the realm of the living in the wake of the light's disturbance. In truth, they merely seek comfort, as well as we all do in these dark times since High Lord Tyrion's passing. However, their unrest threatens the very sanctity of the tomb we have sworn to protect. If we are to restore peace here, then they must be exercised. The reckoning is at hand. All right. So let us do this. That's the thing I gotta do. Consecrate. That one's good to go. All right. Build up that holy power, and then BAM! Judged. You've been judged. That was actually kind of fun. Oh man, don't do that to me. Don't do that to me. Don't make... Ah. Oh, let's fight multiple mobs. It's too far away. Let's do this. BAM! This is pretty cool. Burn. Okay, 
Alright, me just, just hang. Look, they look so cool flying away. Like, look, we're going to heaven. We are so cool. This one's like up on a hill. Consecrate. I did not even take that on the talent tree, but I can use it for a quest. Oh, there's like three over here. Get over here. They're undead, so that's probably why I'm doing so much damage, because they're undead. Middle mouse, yeah. I mean, that's not what the ability is called, that's just what my keybind is. Do I like heal myself with some of these abilities? That's kind of cool. One of my uh, best DPSers that I've ever had in uh, raids. I'm gonna tell him to watch this video because I said that. AKA Bowling Bum. Good friend of mine, William. Sir William. No, Sir Billiam. That's what we call him, Sir Billiam. Um, he is an excellent. I might have to add, come to him for tips and make this one of my fun to play alts. Should be enough, right? Stop bothering me, guys. Alright. Purified the graveyards. If they're purified, there should be no more mobs. Oh, someone else is doing the quest, too. Look at the people doing the quest. Alright. Those poor souls are finally at peace. Thank you, Melar Remember the sun And... Hi, Priest Deldanus. Good, good. Oh, he's usually up at the grave, watching the grave. Good, given time, the last few lingering souls will make their way home. Good luck. We are ready to commune with Lord Uther. Join me at the tomb. All right. It's funny, these people are dead, but you can like, talk to them and stuff. Mm -hmm. I got a meal. Azeroth will not Missy gave not from a living friend, step. but one who passed long ago. Uther the Light Ring was more attuned to the subtleties of the light than any paladin I've ever known. If we reach out to him, he may be able to help us find the Ashbringer. The ceremony has been prepared. Approach the tomb when you are ready. Commune with Uther the Lightbringer. Take care of yourself out there. Uther's resting place lies just ahead. You're pretty cool, dude. Maybe you get to be my uh, my bodyguard. All right, Maxwell. Bill, doing this quest just for you, buddy. Begin when you are ready. Should I kneel first? Let's do it. Be respectful. Light, hear our prayers, for shadows close in around us. 
Grant us this one audience, so the Ashbringer may yet save our world. Yes, it must save our world. <laughs> oh, there he is. Maxwell, my old friend. It's been too long. Uther, it's really you. We're stuck in guilt. You're both doing the light's work. But if you seek to recover the Ashbringer, you must hurry. What for? Oh. Do you know where it is, Uther? We risk everything if we return to that place. <coughs> I can feel the Ashbringer calling out from an island that lies close to the tomb of the Evil One. And the blade is not alone. Tyrion still <gasps> lives, but his light is fading. You must move swiftly, or he will perish. That is all I can tell you. Good luck, friends. Walk all so, the part I saw from another uh, Uther, streamer. Wait. I, I have more to ask you, Uther. Dang. Wow. We will prevail. Even I felt an awe, and I'm not a paladin guy. That was cool. Azeroth will not fall. Tyrion while still we alive. Stand. We have to save him. Light's Hope Chapel is not far from here. We must rally our forces and leave at once for the Broken Shore. Meet Lord Maxwell Tyrosis at Light's Hope Chapel. You can always count on me. All right. Tyrion is still alive. We will save him. Or die trying. It's funny. Is they want me to get the Ashbringer. They're like, hey, get the Ashbringer, man. Uh, but then it's like, oh, Tyrion's alive. He's alive. What if we saved him? Do I get the Ashbringer still? Or does he, you know, that's, that's the question that goes in my mind. Because I'm pretty sure... That he's gonna die. Unless they've changed it. We'll see. We'll see. I always liked uh, Tyrion too. Some people didn't like him. I liked him. I thought he was a cool dude. I remember questing for him. You know, helping get his son back before he was anything. Back before when he had betrayed. Not betrayed, but he left the Silver Hand. Because he was just like... He left just people kind everywhere he was like i'm tired I'm tired of all the fighting and the racism basically we should all be working together and then he came back and then we got him the ashbringer from some dusky tomb in uh I'll find that place for you guys it was howling fjord there was a quest in howling fjord where we found the ashbringer just chilling chilling on a little stone in a low level starting zone for uh for the game. It's like, here you go, get your sword. But now there's an epic quest line for it. There's Arcarus. It's still out here. The Death Knight Zone. It's funny. The so now see the, the the demon the demon oh not demons, the Death Knights, the Demon Hunters have these floating citadels. Whereas I don't know if the Demon Hunter will get to move anywhere other than Mardum, because I think it's staying there until something major happens. Death Knight one can move on the planet and stuff. Um, I'm wondering how the Dalaran can move. There's a lot of floating citadel type stuff. Next round, this is a floating, floating, uh, thing, thing. Oop. We will prevail. We're ready to part when you are. May the light give you strength. Tyrion is, Tyrion is fading away on that infernal shore, and the Ashbringer with him. We must not waste another moment. Give the word, and we'll set off. We're ready when you are. Recover Tyrion, forging, and the Ashbringer from the broken shore. Walk all ways. You brave souls have been chosen to strike into the depths of hell itself to rescue High Lord Tyrion. This <coughs> is your last chance to turn back. Ready yourselves, men. The broken shore awaits. We leave in our champion's command. And the champion, the Argent Hippogriff, and then probably loading screen. Yep, that's like a terrible resolution. It was like 800 by 600. What the heck? Lead the paladins of the Argent Crusade into battle. So this is going to be tough because. The demons before us are all that stand between us and the Ashbringer. Regardless of the outcome, 
Our families will know that we fought for the freedom and safety of our world. We move on our champion's wow. command. Oh, Argent Warhorn. Let's do this. Argent Crusade? Charge! Must be punished. Oh no, they're all attacking me. That was probably not a good idea. But it feels good to do so much damage. Distribution. I don't have a card. I think we did it. Infernals. Oh. Man. Champion, we must persevere. I'm trying to persevere. Am I the only one left? I need to talk to the earth behind us. I must finish breaking our guest. Destroy Jailer Zerus. I am the only one. The Everyone's fiends have Tyrion. We have to act quickly. Just me and everyone else died. Champion, I'll signal for our hippogriff riders to get our fallen to Light's Hope Chapel. You must forge ahead and find the High Lord. You see, in truth, this is totally stupid. It's like, yeah, hey, you go fight. I will call for help. Whoa. Oh, oh, oh. Bob and weave. Oh, you mortals are so vain. I need to get close. So arrogant. You will suffer for Oh, air up there. Oh shoot. Her mind rendered me. I don't have a card. You have three holy power. The sundering of this one's soul has been taxing. But he will be ours soon. I bet you Tyrion is right. Burnt in my heart. I will never surrender. It's Tyrion. I'll save you, Tyrion. Hopefully. We'll see. Let's go, Zerus. Suffer for a thousand lifetimes. Uh... By the light! Stop doing that. May I interrupt you? Nope. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to stun him. Dang it. Didn't mean to do that. Burning paladins. Oh. Uh, interrupted. Oh. Insignificant. Shh. I'm out of range. Not gonna get me. Not gonna get me. Tyrion! By all that is holy, what have they done to you? Oh, now you show up. I'll break Tyrion free. 
You must find the Ashbringer while there's still time. Guess I go this way. Let's go. The Lost Temple. I'm sure someone will tell me I'm doing something wrong. This is the thing I didn't like about Paladin. It just felt like I need to get close. the mortal approaches the ice cream with two arms. Maybe you just need I need more haste. I need a target. Cause I've seen I've seen Bill I've seen Bowling Bum like sit there and just go to town. They say only the pure can wield the high blade. Come, champion. Claim your destiny. Let's get to take it. Of course, you're gonna drop in and take it from me. Oh. Sweet. Quest over. That was cool. I need to get close. I've been waiting for you, Paladin. Know that I will rip the soul from your flesh and make your body my own. Oh shit. What the hell? I can't do what I will turn you into I a use weapon my of the Legion. No. I will use your hollow shell to corrupt and destroy everything you have ever loved. Oh, this piece sucks. by piece. Why did I use my cooldown? Now kneel. Kneel before your new master. Call upon Give the power of the strength to shatter these bonds. Oh, and call upon the power of spring free from Bell and Azar's control. Sweet. <laughs> you cannot fight my will. You are mine. Very well. This will be a fire test. Know that I am Balnazar. Know right. that you are but a pawn in plans beyond your reckoning. Oh, where'd he go? It's too far away. Stop doing that. You are oh. here because I will it. You live because I will it, and you will serve because I will it. Do you I'm think out of range. So uh, I need to get close. Oh, the lake. Interrupt. Burn everything, my pet. Stop it. Leave only ash. But I'm the ash bringer. You Impressive. can't. I did not expect you to attune to the Ashbringer so quickly. No matter. I'm out of range. I will finish you off personally. What can I use lay on hands? Not for a while. Oh no, I did something. Well, I stunned him with the Ashbringer. Enough! Never again will that damn blade slay my brethren. You will die! Oh shit, things are not looking good. 
I need to get close. Ugh. No. Yeah. It's because this. If I had this, <sighs> that sucks. Flash out with the ash bringer. Dealing the radiant damage always in fire for me and reducing the demon and undead enemies are stunned for six seconds if struck by the weak of ashes. Dang it. So much but look oh he's full health again. Alright, need our cooldown. Let's rebuff. Oh, I forgot to put a flash of light. It's not on my bar. I was wondering what's going on. It's like, where's my flash of light at? Let's put that there. Alright. Now I can flash a light when things get really bad. Yep. That'll work. Stuff doesn't cost mana. Mana's just for healing. Alright, let's do this. It's too far away. Dang it, what's the mind there? Know that I am Balnazar. Know that you are but a pawn in plans beyond your reckoning. Let's go. Spend in it. You are here because I will. I need to talk You live first. because I will it. And you will serve because I will it. And you'll shut up. It's too far it's away. Stunned. It's almost time for it. Wake of ashes. Stun you more. I'm out of range. Just to stand oh, alone. Ah, uh, shit. Burn everything, my pets. Leave only ash. I need to get closer. Impressive. I did not expect you to attune to the Ashbringer so quickly. No matter. I will finish you off personally. I'm out of range. I need to get closer. Enough! Never again will that damned blade slay my brethren. You will die! Oh well. Got you on lockdown, buddy. It's too far away. Uh. It's done. You I think this target. is over, Paladin? I don't have a target. Our journey together has yes. just begun. I, I kind of figured it out. I didn't even realize I had quickly. that on my bar. Tyrion called for you by name. Sure, I somebody was screaming, "Hey, you got, you got a new ability! Hurry. You got a new ability!" It's like, "Hey, buddy, use your ability to stun him." Whew. Why did you leave him, Tyrosis? We have to him? get out of here before more demons come. Quickly, the High Lord is just outside the temple. Run faster. Stormwood footmen, when did they get in here? I guess they fell with Tyrion. And that guy was like, I will be the hero. The hero that this world needs. Oh man. Come closer. <coughs> you must wield the blade. You must stop the Legion. You must become Let me heal you. the Ashbringer. No. You will be missed, brother. Damn it. 
Bye, Tyrion. We must go to Light's Hope Chapel at once. High Lord Fordring deserves to be put to rest among the ancient heroes of the Light buried there. All right. At your service. We will prevail. We must put our Tyler to in there is one place suitable for a paladin of his caliber, Light's Hope Sanctum, a secret bastion of the light hidden beneath our chapel. Paladins the world over will join us for the ceremony. I know Tyrion would want you there most of all. Join the other paladins at Light's Hope Sanctum beneath Light's Hope Chapel in the Eastern Plagueland. May the we light... gave everything for the Ashbringer. You gave everything. Tyrion would be proud to see you wielding that blade. You told me about it. You heard him. So, uh, let's go. Where'd you hypocrite? It's optional. It's like you can get out here on your own. You get hurt and stuff, but it's not as cool. <laughs> My mount is standing on midair. Solemn march. Paying our respects to Tyrion, we gotta do the solemn march. Man, Tyrion is cool. It really, it's like we lost Tyrion, we lost Varian, all the Ians. They've known about this place for a while. This is this place is probably like a, a club for paladins, you know, that like it was just like straight up like in the air, and there was just like a mass of like uh, black lights and fog lights and fog and drinking and debauchery and orgies all going on for paladins down here. And they're like, "Oh, Tyrion's dead. No more, none of that. He was probably the leader of it all." They're like, "How's the new guy gonna handle it?" Check it out, they're all kneeling for me as I walk by with the Ashmere. This is sweet. I forgot that this was, I mean, I don't remember, you know? This is just, look at them all kneeling. Blood Guardians, Silverhand Protectors, the Ashbringer. You're not supposed to talk. Oh, you're a named person. Grime and Stoutmantle, Grime and Stoutmantle. Silver Highguard. It's funny, these guys have like a ton of health, like 3 million health, but they're less like, yeah, you're not good enough. You didn't kneel. You're supposed to kneel, Silver High Guard. This place looks really cool. Look at this. Are these all named people? I don't have to check that out. Azeroth will not it's fitting that you are here. Time and again, you have fought to save our world. Now I fear I must ask you to undertake an even greater act of service. A united force. The paladins of Azeroth must stand united behind a single leader. With Tyrion's passing, you are the one most worthy to wear the mantle of High Lord. If you agree to accept this duty, inscribe your name into the Librum of Ancient Kings, and I will address the masses on your behalf. The Order of the Silver Hand is reborn, and with you as its champion. Establish the Order of the Silver Hand using the Librum of Ancient Take Kings. Take care of yourself out there. These fine men and women need a leader. Your deeds right. prove you are the clear choice to we bear that burden. Sunwalker Desco. I will address them on Thomas, your behalf. Crusader Lord Lantinga. Brander Ironhammer. Capitals. Paladins All of, of Azeroth. people. You've gathered to mourn the loss of High Lord Tyrion Fortune. Edric. Many of you look to him as an ideal. The paragon of what we all strive to be. I like Edric. He's cool. Let us observe a moment of silence for a great soldier, leader. Arator, oh my god. In the light we are one, brother. Always. It's the son of Aurelian Teralion. Inscribe your name into the Librum of Ancient Kings, so that we may begin the ceremony. Hold on, just making sure I know. The Lickord Dawnbringer, Lady Laredrin's there. Do, 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 do. All right, walking up. Let's grab my name. 
You all know the noble deeds of the champion at my side. This hero has been chosen by the Light to succeed Tyrion as High Lord. Under our new leader, this order shall become a mighty weapon brought to bear against the Legion. We must stand together against the coming darkness. We must cast aside the shackles of race and kingdom. We must unite as one! Girl! Somebody's cheering. Oh, she stood up. The Blood Knights stand by you, High Lord. Azeroth will not fall. I am the Blade of the Light. We pledge ourselves to your cause, High Lord. You know what? Who I really wanted to be here? But he's dead too. On this day, oh, wait. the Order of the Silver Hand is reborn. Together, Sargeras himself shall shudder at our might. Yeah, cheer for me. That's so cool. Alright. Just the two dudes. You know who should be here instead of Vindicator Boros? Sorry, I was responding to somebody. Uh, Vindicator Boros. It should have been um, Maraud. Way cooler than Boros. Boros boring. Maraud's the true guy that deserves to be here. But they killed him off too. Oh, I gotta turn in the quest. I walk back up here. At your service. We've done it, Gladius. The Order of the Silver Hand is reborn. Forging new strength. Even the most nefarious Legion Lords fear your presence on the battlefield, yet they are relentless, fashioning ever more terrible horrors and fiends in hopes of countering your might. High Lord, we must augment your power to maintain our edge over the enemy. The altar before you holds within it the essence of the countless heroes of the light buried in these sacred halls. Place your weapon upon the altar and imbue it with new strength. Oh, Always I count on me. Walk. Place the blade on the altar when you are oh, ready. Straight up, right the up light here. will be our forge. So, so you got the wake of ashes. Increases damage dealt by Crusader Strike. So we're gonna get Echo of the High Lord. Ashbringer mimics Templar's Herdic and Divine Storm, dealing 10% of normal. That's only that's it. 10% of it. Divine Tempest, Ashbringer projects Divine Storm forward 20 yards, damaging all enemies in its path. Path also increases damage dealt by Divine Storm. And then over here, Ashes, two Ashes. Wake of Ashes also generates five holy power and causes all enemies hit to burn. I'm going for that first if I do this properly. Now appearances. So we have, you got your standard one, your ugly yellow and blue one, Weird blue and yellow one. And then, why? Green handle? Ugh. Great sword of the righteous. This looks sick. Wow. Oh, I love that. That's the blue handled one. The blue bladed one. Ooh. And then the green one again. The green looks wrong for this weapon. I'm leaning towards the main color or the... This blue one's cool too. I really like this version of it. Burning Reprisal. Oh my god, that looks even cooler. It's just a sword of frozen flames. Except for the like bits of flame here. But the rest of it's like a crystalline fire. And then there's a blue one, which also looks cool. This blue one looks cool too. This time a green one looks cool. And then a yellow one. I'd probably go with the yellow one because it's unique. It's like a golden flame of holy light. Alright, and there's the PvP one kind of alright, it's whatever. not really liking the PvP one. And the hidden one, we don't know yet. Sweet. We will prepare. I will continue beseeching the light to bolster the power of your weapon. For now, its newfound strength should be more than enough. 
I think we're ready to reintroduce ourselves to Legion on the Broken Isles. Lord Grayson Shadowbreaker has volunteered to help coordinate our forces on the ground. You should speak with him immediately, High Lord. Speak to Lord Grayson Shadowbreaker. Take care Lord of Shadowbreaker will be expecting you. This way. Lead the way, Tyros. Tyros is Maxwell. Why do you run faster than me? Somebody just... Oh. He's like, dude, just, I said, why do you run faster than me? And then he just gave me the marks of the High Lord. So only for five minutes. I think Gladius is a demigod. Yeah, I'm a demigod. Lord Shadowbreaker, the High Lord would like to peruse the reconnaissance you've gathered on the Broken Isles. Where's Shadowbreaker? Oh, he's over here. Light be with you. Now is the time to strike back against the Legion. The Legion still believes us crippled from the broken shore. They think we are unable to fight back. Let's prove them wrong. We've been hard at work mapping out the broken isles, learning everything we can about each region for our imminent assault. Once you've had a chance to peruse the map, you should leave for Dalaran at once and charge into the Maw of the Beast. We will end this madness for good. Light help us all. Select your first assault point. Honor, so this this is where you pick your place, you know, do 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 do, do thing. First questing zone. And that's the Ashbringer quest line, guys. Took a little bit longer. Sorry for the death. I am very new to paladins and I didn't really understand what I was doing. But I had fun and the lore is sick. Alright, I will see you guys in the next one. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. There is only, at the time of this recording, three more days left before the winner of the contest will be announced. $50 gift card to Jinx for some cool gamer swag. Alright, see you guys in the next one. Peace out.